well dried at all. Anyway, I'll have to splice this together. I'll have to figure out how to do it. This is part two. <laughs> There's Jack, all wet, and Jarvis, and a chicken. Hi. You always come say hi. Look at your eye. You pretty? It's like you got something in your pocket. I know. I know. I've got something in my pocket for you. I know. I know. You want it? You have to be good. Can you back up? <laughs> back up. You're too close. <laughs> He's like, I know you got something in your pocket. So his feet look pretty good. Hi. No, you can't have my phone. And uh, keep his forelock nice and long. And keep it all the flies out of his eyes. I know. I got something in my pocket. You want it? Hold on. Hold on. There you go. <laughs> there you go. And Jarvis is over there. He don't care. But, uh, these are the apple trees. They're in the pasture. So I know I probably won't have many apples on, like, a normal horsey height. They don't seem to be eating the tree too, too much, which is kind of nice. Um, I sprayed it because of this little stuff here. Hi. I know, I know, I know. Hi, Jarvis. So, um, but I've got quite a bit of apples on these. So my guess is when they get ripe, they're not going to be around. Because <laughs> these guys are going to help themselves to the apples. But really, Jack, you're behind me. Hi. Hello. I know. This jacket is nice and soft, isn't it? So, um, my guess is they, uh, excuse me, dude. Can I, can I come in through here? Oh, thank you. So they're pretty big. I mean, good size. They're red delicious. As you can see, they're starting to ripen up a little bit. You know, just a little bit. And there's a whole bunch of them. Oh my gosh, I'm going to be able to sell some of these. And uh, there's a nice little red one there. And that one there. So I'm going to spray it. You know, give it some fertilizer. Hey, you want to? And the last one, let me get that fly out of your eye. This one too. Yeah, it's a good boy. I know. You're such a good boy. I'm all done. You ate them all. You ate every one of them. Yep, you did. <laughs> they don't seem to eat the tree too, too much. Now, of course, he's going to call me a liar. Nope, he just broke it. So my guess is I'm not going to have too many apples. Like, there's a lot of apples on this tree. A lot of apples. Look at all these apples here. Well, <laughs> my big turbo couch is in the way. Good picture of his drip line. Look at that, Jarvis. I know. That looks really nice. How the spur just comes right down and the rain comes down. Him and his big hips. Now you can see his belly comes down underneath his belly and his whole belly is dry and it drips right here. See? He just missed two drips. So his belly stays dry and warm. <laughs> I love his little curly cue right there. <laughs> That's cute. Hi chicken. What do you want chicken? Yeah? Alright. So let's go back inside. Oh, I was going to show you my peaches. You going to show you peaches? Yeah? You going to eat? What you got going on? Why you get bit? Why are you itchy? Do you have a tick or something right here? Why are you so itchy right here? You're so itchy. I got that itch for you. I got it. <laughs> it's got a little bump right here. I don't know if maybe it's a bee sting or something. It doesn't seem to bother him. But sometimes I try to get their itches. Jack's drip line's a little bit different. You can still see it, but <laughs> he thinks I told him to move away. Yeah, I know. Your nose. Nah, nah, nah. Play with your nose. <laughs> oh, he's such a good boy. He's such a good dog. Good horse. A good dog. All right, let's go check out my, my peach trees. All right, well, these are my peach trees. Um, but I think they were sick anyway when I first moved in. Hi, chickens. What do you guys want? You troublemakers. All five of you. Oh, I just walked through a spider web. Ugh, I hate that. 
Hi, troublemakers. One, two, three, four, five. The other one's on the other side. So anyway, I thought they were a little sick because they had a, um, oh, I forget what you call it. It's a knot that explodes and all the sap comes out of it. Let me see if I can find a part. It's like a, I forget the name of it. Maybe you guys know. Um, but I trimmed it all up because it wasn't trimmed. So now, this is a peach, but now you can see it's all rotted. So I think this is sick. This one's, this one's not too bad. I think that one's going to be okay. Let's see if we can get focused because I think my lens is dirty. Lenses might be wet. There we go. Sorry about that. But that peach is there. And then uh, there's that one. Let's try this lens. But I think that one's okay. Yeah, that one doesn't look too bad. It looks like it'll be okay. It's, they're still kind of small right now. Um, there's not a lot on here. I mean, there's that one that's rotted. I pulled off two other ones that were rotted. Um, there's this one over here. That one looks like it's okay. That one looks like it's okay. But there's none, like, high up. They're all just, like, right here. And there's only, like, four. So, I'm not really sure what happened if this was covered in flowers. So... I don't know much about peach trees. I had peach trees at my other house. And they, they weren't big enough. They didn't, um... See, look, this one's get rotted, too. See how it's all rotted on the top? So I was gonna pull it off. And that one. That one's got mold growing on it. That's what happened to the other one. It had, like, a little bit of mold stuff going on it. So, I'm not really... Or mildew. I'm not really sure what it's called. I don't know. I'll have to do some research. And then I thought there was one over here that maybe it's the one that I pulled off and I threw it in the trash and burnt it. But I think the tree is just really sick. It's got like, it's all beat up. It's got all these scars all over it. It's not even sitting right in the ground. I mean, these people really did not know how to take care of these. It looks like at the beginning they did because that's really nice, the setup. Sorry, I gotta, oh, there, hopefully that helps. Um, it's a nice open setup, you know, where you, because peach trees, you have to have the middle open. And I trimmed it in the, the spring or the fall when I, when I moved first here. And um, it's looking like it's bouncing back pretty good, but I don't know. Oh, there's, a, there's another one over there. I don't know if you guys can see it. It's a crazy phone. I've got to get a real decent camera for this stuff. This is crazy. My, I bought another lens because it broke. Go away, chicken! Go away! You're a pain. You two sparkles. And hop along. And hop along look like. You're annoying. Crazy birds love them to pieces. <laughs> they give me eggs, so I love them. So I gotta, my day was supposed to pull all this up and till it, but it's raining. I don't want to get wet. So let's, uh, let's see if anybody's laid any eggs. But that's the, the property. There's all my fruit trees. And I thought maybe this was a nut tree. I have no clue what this is. Um, that's the, bar the bark on it. And the leaves are kind of pointy like that. Like a, um, oh, what the heck is it? Anyway, it had, um, they're smooth, you know, they're, they're not jagged on the edges and they had these really cute little bell shaped, there we are, flowers and this whole thing, it sounded like a massive beehive in here. There were so many bees, um, but now all the flowers are on the ground. They're all dead. I don't know what it's going to generate. And I'm trying to figure out what it is. And nobody seems to know what it is. Do we have a chicken? Oh, there's an egg. No chickens in here. You know, chicken, you have plenty of places to lay your eggs. Why do you... This is, this is you. This is all you. Yeah, that's you. Laying your egg right here at the door. 
Uh huh. Get out. <laughs> so nobody else has laid their eggs in their baskets like they're supposed to. And uh, maybe it was you. Yeah, this this kind of looks like you. But uh, I've got to get back in here and kind of go on, go on. You're not allowed to come out. Go on. You don't come out this way. You think so, but you don't. <laughs> so I got four yesterday. I think this is the Easter egg. She tends to lay oval eggs, you know, a little bit more oval than some of the other ones. So that's probably her, Miss Ugly Pants. All right, well, I'm going to head back inside and uh, we have to have a burn for all the cardboard, but unfortunately. Um, ah, look at that. <laughs> Fortunately, it's all wet, so we can't burn for a few days until it freaking dries out. It doesn't rain for one day. That would be nice. I mean, I feel like I'm in Scotland. It rains every day. Oh, well. Oh, well. Well, let's go see what's on these cards, and uh, I'll post up another video. Have a good day.